here there in today's video we will be learning something interesting we will be learning how to make this captain america shield so let's get started so the first step is we'll delete this cube by pressing the delete button then we will add a cylinder then we will scale it along the z axis and now we'll scale this this one now again we'll scale it make it little but more thinner So this is perfect. Now we will go into the edit mode by pressing tab and then we will select the face select mode. We will select the face and we will extrude it inwards. So to do that press E and scale it inwards. So press E then S and then inwards. We do that again, E, S, N, and then again, E, S, N. Okay, so now this looks kind of flat. So to get that curvy surface, what we will do is we will select this surface uh, this face the entire face by pressing alt then again this face shift alt sorry by pressing alt then again shift alt select then shift select now we go into the side view now we'll grab this along the z-axis so to do that press g z then this much and then just grab it this much okay now we will select this face side view grab it again along the z-axis mm -hmm. yeah then this face side view G Z okay now we got the basic structure of the shield so now we will be adding one texture to it that is the stainless steel texture so to do that we will go in the shading mode add a new material shift A texture image texture and then we will connect this color to base color and I'll open the texture image and you can download it from Google any stainless steel texture image you can download so I'll choose this texture And as we know the shield is made of metal so we will give it a metallic look so by increasing the metallic value okay this looks good and then to give it a shiny look we will just reduce the roughness okay so now we add another material so we go in material properties click on this plus sign and then new we will choose the red color then one more material new a blue color 
and then one more material new silver color okay so now we go into the layout mode and we start filling our colors so to do that we will first select this face so alt click mm, then material properties red color assign so now you can see the red color is assigned to it now again we will increase the metallic value somewhere around 0.875 and we reduce the roughness to give it a shiny look now we select this face and we give it a silver color assign then increase the metallic value and reduce the roughness now again the same thing select this face we will give it a red color and assign now to this inner face we will give a blue material assign it then again do the same increase the metallic value and reduce the roughness okay so we got the shield basic structure and we have colored the shield as well now ah yeah we will delete this face so select this face press x and faces so now we got that hollow shield mm. now the next task is to add the star star in the center of the shield so to do that to do that shift a we will add a circle okay oh, first we will go in object mode now we will add a circle by pressing shift a circle and then we will make the vertices value as 10 and just grab it over here now we will go in the edit mode by pressing tab and make sure you select the vertex select option and select every other vertices so select By pressing shift you can select it and then we will scale it inwards so to do that press s and scale it so now you can see we got the star so we'll just add a face so select the entire star and press f now we got the face now we'll just put this star on the shield oh yeah side view mm. to do that shift a we will add a circle first we will go in object mode now we will add a circle by pressing shift a circle and then we will make the vertices value as 10 and just grab it over here now we will go in the edit mode by pressing tab and make sure you select the vertex select option and select every other vertices 
so select by pressing shift you can select it and then we will scale it inwards so to do that press s and scale it so now you can see we got the star so we'll just add a face so select the entire star and press f now we got the face now we'll just put the star on the shield oh yeah side view it's on the shield now we will scale it press s and just scale it okay so now we are done with the star now we will add a material so new material we will give the base color as silver and then again do the same increase the metallic value and decrease the roughness make 